Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It's my pleasure to present my paper. My paper is a time-based distributed collaborative filtering recommendation algorithm. The outline of my talk as follows. The first part of I want to introduce the background of this research. The second part, I will discuss the related work. The third part covers the problem description and the algorithm implementation. And then we describe the performance evaluation. Finally, a simple conclusion is given. Well, let's move on the first part of this topic, introduction. It includes three parts, background, problem, and our work. Background. The problem of information overload has become increasingly serious. The emergence of the recommendation systems can help people to obtain the interest, interest information. The collaborative filtering algorithm has been widely applied in various re recommendation systems. Many research ex explore Hadoop and Spark to improve the parallelism of recommendation system operations. Problem. However, the existing research many study the process of metric decomposition composition and the iterative phase to improve the algorithm of outlaying least square. The consideration of parallel execution of data pre-processing is not enough. Algorithm accuracy can be improved by means of pre-processing data such as normalization. Our work thus, we improve the original algorithm within the Spark platform by exploring influence of the type factor to adjust data set scores. Experimental results validate the effectiveness of our proposal in terms of the accuracy of root mean square error. Let's move to the next uh, topic, related work. Uh, we noticed many efforts are based on new computing models, platforms, parallels many classical machine learning algorithms. Many researchers focus on algorithm, phrase workers, and uh, model. So pre-processing is not enough. Uh, next. Uh, Problem description. We are the rating representatives, the user preference for item. This metric is usually very sparse. Most of the scoring elements are missing, and our task is to predict the missing values in it. The blue blue elements. Represents the 
value. The green elements represent uh, the missing debt. User supporting behavior and item in recommendation systems can be expressed as a metrical P. Metrical P is composed of two low dimensional metrical U and V. The minimum squared error loss function L is used to compute U and V while avoiding the overfitting problem. So let's see the equation. Traditional metrical decompositions are difficult to handle huge data given a large size of metrical P. It computes U and V in equation uh, in equation 5, where k is the minimum of m and n, it is also as implicit a semantic factor. The objective is to minimize the squared error loss function in equation 6. A regularization term is applied to avoid the overfitting in equation 7. Uh, the calculation process is as follows. Set initial values V and U. Find the, the partition derivative of function L for X and let the partition derivative equal to zero to get x. Similarly, it is expected to get equation 9. Continue steps 2 and 3 until convergence. So we consider time factor. In equation 10, we rearrange the rating. It happens frequently that movies with low rating at initial releasing periods become classical along with time. Thus, the time factor should be one of criteria and ratings. Notice that the tra traditional feathers ignores influence of vectors of different periods and rating that flap to it over time. Next, uh, let's see algorithm design. Figure 1 shows the process of our algorithm. It includes four components to pre-process data to find the minimum and maximum time steps of all users' costs corresponding to each item, and to update the costs in the original data by means of equation 10 and equation 11. In Algorithm 1, data processing. The input is data set D to be processed and the outer is the data set S after the correction of score item according to time vector. In Algorithm 2, recommendation are reason. The parameter max iter is the number of iterations at runtime. Each iteration can improve the accuracy of algorithm. Rank is the number of implicit symmetric factors in the model. That is the number of features. REG parameter is a regularization parameter of LS. 
So let's uh, see uh, the perfor uh, performance evaluation. We applied the metrical RMS in equation 12 to evaluate our model, where n represents the number of experiment samples. P and uh, R represent uh, the predicted and observed scores of user U for movie I, respectively. Let's see a picture to illustrate uh, the results. Figure 2. Figure 2 demonstrates uh, that the improved uh, algorithm has a significant uh, improvement in RMSE. Specifically, RMSE fluctuates slightly while rank uh, changes from uh, th 3 to 10, which indicates that rank should not be too large. In figure 3, this shows that model is more stable given millions of debt. RMSE gradually decreases with lambda from 1 to 1. Point zero, when the lambda is close to 0 0.5, the RMSE reaches its lowest value. So we have the conclusion. This proposal a time-based distributed parallel recommendation algorithm in the Spark platform. The results shows that our proposal outperforms the collaborative filtering algorithm and it reaches stable fast. We have verified its effectiveness on RMSE with multiple parameters, including the number of implicit symmetric factors, the number of iterations, and the regularization term. Thank you.